this program to bring you a special report. Good morning, my YouTube family. What is up? I hope y'all are all having a wonderful day today. Um, I want to give a little shout out um, this morning um, to my girls, Lisa and Becky, um, from Southern Comfort Live Talk and Night Watch uh, Searching for Souls, and then my girl Becky's channel. I'm going to put all of my links in the description. Also, I want to give a shout out to my boy Corey from Abandoned Boys. Love you, Corey. You're the bomb. Thank you so much for all the support and love that you've given me. Really appreciate that a lot. My girl Brittany, Hazel Eyed Siren, you're the bomb girl. We have so much fun. And then my boy Oz and Fa, you guys have been the best. Thank you for your support as well. And to my really good friend Barefoot Adventures for all of his love and support as well. So today, guys, I want to talk about um, something that happened to me a couple of nights ago on uh, my friend's stream. And uh, before you say anything, no, she, it wasn't her fault. Um, and she actually supported me and tried to help me out along with a couple of other people in the chat. Um, shout out to Full Metal Jacket as well for helping. Thank you so much. Um, check him out, Mickey, Mickey Nixon Films. Um, so I was live a couple of nights ago on my girl Brittany's live stream and, um, I had come up, uh, to cheer her up for a little bit before I went to bed. And as soon as I got down off the stream, um, in the chat, these two guys decided that they wanted to, um, call me fat and I don't really care, um, what they think or what people say about me personally because I'm comfortable with my own body my own skin it's fine um, but today I sort of wanted to talk about you know hate speech and a lot of times what you say to people um, you don't know what they're going through they could have had a family member pass away they could have lost their job something could have happened and when you in a sense you bully them or you call them that name or you say something that's not nice or whatever it is um you know it can really affect somebody a lot and um so you just really really should be careful what you say um don't say anything that you wouldn't want said back to you or to your mother or your brother or your sister or somebody in your family think about what you're saying and think about how you would feel if that came back to you um, to what you're doing to other people you know this world has just gotten really really bad with hate crimes and you know racism and stuff like that it's just no need for it um, you know you could you can really do a lot more with a hug a handshake a compliment you know if you don't have anything nice to say just walk by and smile that, that's all you have to do you don't you don't want to take take and make somebody's day that could be really really bad and make it that much worse because um, that can lead to other things as well um, if y'all haven't ever seen the series on Netflix um, 13 reasons why um, you really ought to watch it that one sort of hit home for me because I actually had a friend um, that that sort of thing happened to and um, I don't really want to go into a whole lot of details um, but she's no longer with us um, so anyway you guys just please be careful what you say to people um my son actually um happened last year at school he actually ended up getting bullied by some boys at school calling him names stick and things like that and it didn't bother him but they just kept on and they were really persistent about it so um worse came to worse and uh, my son and the other boy decided they were going to meet in the bathroom after school um to fight you know to sort of duke it out or whatever and so um my son and the the boy ended up the bully ended up hitting my son and ran away um you know of course like the little brat he was um they both ended get ended up getting suspended um because of course the school has a zero tolerance policy which i'm really happy with so anyway and it wasn't just him then there was another boy that was picking on him at school and you know it just kept on for a little while and you know until Aiden um, my son finally stood up for himself so anyways you know it's just it's really tough to try to internalize what people are saying to you when they're constantly beating you up constantly putting you down constantly saying just bad things so 
I just wanted to sort of put this video out there to, to say, please just be conscious of what you're saying to people, whether it's over the internet, whether it's in person, you know, whether it's on the phone, um, whoever it is that you're talking to, they may not be having the best day. So just think about that um, next time you want to call somebody a name or you want to cuss at somebody or something like that. I know I'm guilty of it too. Occasionally when I, when I drive, I'm not the nicest, but you, just spread the love. Spread the love, not the hate. Um, that's all I really wanted to say, guys. I hope y'all are having a wonderful and blessed day. Please make sure you hit that thumbs up button and smash that bell. And um, I'll have some new content out for you guys soon. Thank you so much, guys. Love you so much. Peace.